do? Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Clem, you made the right choice. I let you down. <coughs> I let everyone down. Why did you make me do this? I'm sorry, Clementine. We almost made it. We were close, weren't we? <coughs> I thought I wanted this. Asked for it so many times. Now that it's happening, I'm scared. <coughs> it's okay, Kenny. You're... You're going to see Kutch and Duck. You're going to see them again. Oh, you're always good for a smile. This is sad because... <laughs> It reminds me of the the last few days when my granny was alive and she didn't die of cancer or anything but she she was locked away in like a hospital for the last few months of her life and she didn't really recognize anybody anymore she was she was super like aware of everything oh god sorry that's going to sound terrible she was super aware of everything like her entire life and right up until she went into hospital but as soon as she went into hospital and she was starting to get treated for um I, I can't remember what it was she had she had something in her leg that spread through her body and affected her blood but she was in hospital for a few months before she died and her mind just completely went and I remember going in one time with my sister to see her and we were talking to her, and my granny was like, Is Sean gonna come in to visit us? And I, I was sitting right next to her, and she didn't know who I was. And that was really sad. Again, she didn't die of cancer or anything, it's just reminding me of it. And I need to move on, or I won't be able to move on. For Joel Evan Green. J-E-G. Oh, he was real. <laughs> I was really hoping all that time it wasn't real, that it was just a story. That's so sad.
<laughs> you look like such a happy little boy. <laughs> That's the face of mischief right there. That's a child who has done <laughs> scandalous little things. I have no regrets. I've seen too much horror. I hope fate has been more merciful to you. Our time on Earth is brief, and mine has been filled with so much joy that I can only be thankful for how much I've been blessed. Most specially, for the wonder you brought into my life. This letter is my last. I've been found guilty by a military court for the death of an officer. It was not my intention to kill him. War makes men mad. Though I failed, Carl, I know my sacrifice has not been in vain. I fought for my country and my liberty. My honor is assured. Since it is the will of God to separate us on earth, I hope we'll meet again in heaven. This is sad. Keep me in your prayers. Your loving Papa. Always. Even though their bodies have long since returned to dust, their sacrifice still lives on. We must strive to cherish their memory and never forget. <laughs> when do you have to die? And he died thinking the Carol was dead. Oh, fucking hell! Stupid game. But I, I started making videos here on my own and you guys have like started watching my videos and you guys afforded me the chance to go off and do this as like my job to do it, it doesn't even feel like a job it, it still feels so much fun and I really love doing it and it's all because of you guys and I'm really thankful for that every day and you guys changed so much about my life in this one year I mean because we started the channel at 30,000 subscribers at the start of the year and now it's almost at 2 million by the end of it and it's just crazy what's happened in this one year alone and it's all because of you like all I do is the same as I've ever done it's just me sitting on my own in my room shouting at my computer at my, at my microphone uh, my microphone and my computer probably hate me because I hurl abuse at them all the time 
But you guys have what, are what made the channel what it is right now. You guys have boosted it so much further than I ever thought it would be. Because I didn't think this would be my job. I didn't intend for this to be my job. It's amazing that I get to do it as my job. But I just did it because it was fun. I still do it because it's fun. Um, I, I just started making videos because I liked playing games. And I saw other people do it and I thought, hey, that looks cool. I want to do that. And it's morphed into something way beyond I could ever imagine. And I'm so grateful for it. You have no idea. This was a heavy loss that we all feel. And all of you out there probably feel because in, in small ways that you probably didn't know, Daniel was part of what I did. A big part of what I did. And Daniel, like he, uh, he did a lot of things that were often unseen. And I just hope that he knew how much I respected him as a friend. Uh, anyway. Just thank you guys so much for your support. Thank you so much for understanding, and we will be back. Just send a lot of love, you know, send a lot of love towards the other guys. They're, they really need it now. <clears throat> and just thank you guys so much for being patient. We really appreciate it. No, no, no! No! I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. <laughs> Oh god damn it! Already? Already with the fucking gut punches game! Thank you so much. You'll never know how grateful I am because I can never put it into words. As long as I live, I'll never be able to put it into words how grateful I am for this stuff. And I'm sorry if I've kind of gone off the rails lately with um, certain types of games and certain types of commentary. I'll try bring it back to these kind of things where it's longer and just more in touch with me, where you get to know more about me, you get to listen to me a lot longer. It's not just all about dick jokes and, like, super highly edited stuff all the time. Um, I know a lot of you really like these longer videos that are uncut, and I'm sorry if I, like, let some of you down. <laughs> sorry! <sighs> I'm sorry if I, like, if people thought I was going off in a bad direction, like, playing stuff like Honey Pop or anything like that. I, I'm, I'm really not trying to um, like, be all about boobs and that kind of thing, and stupid jokes. I, I thank you guys just so much for being here. But just thank you guys so much. Without oh, without you, I'm nothing. I mean, I live on my own now, and if you guys weren't there commenting to me every single day, I'd be so lonely and on my own every single day. And it's, it's great to have such, so many people care so much about you, because I care a lot about each and every one of you. I love you guys to bits. You're like the heart. You every reason that I have to get up in the day is because of you guys, all the time. And I I love just what I do right now. It's all because of you. And I want you guys to remember that that because of you I get to do this. And this is like a big journey that we all get to go on together. So just thank you so much.